All right, we're here this morning. This is part two on cleaning the northern pike. This is removing it from the skin. Okay, go ahead and talk us through it. All right, some people have that little, the, the thing there and do it all the way. If you don't, yeah. I found an easier way is just to, Okay. here's about the Y bone start. So you just start right about here. Nice. All the way down to the skin. Uh -huh. Turn your blade towards the skin, go real easy. Now do you point the tip of your knife towards the skin? Yep, so I got okay, a little turn so in. you got it, okay. It's real easy. All right. Real easy, real easy. There you go, there's okay. one flay. And that's mostly right. the wide bone right there. Down here is the, the, the back of it, where the uh -huh. tail meat is. There's Here, no wide bone in no there? There's no wide bone in there. Okay. We'll, be, we'll double check it, and then again. Okay. Come in there. Point your knife down. Point it down. Just use the skin and, and the, the skin, to skin and a little bit of the knife, and, and voila. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh, that's nice. Now, if you were a, a white person traveling, you'd have to leave a little bit of that skin on, to, so they can know. What do you mean? If you're traveling anywhere, so like if you travel with fillets, uh -huh. you can't just have cold with fillets like that. If oh, you're you native, can't. if you're native, you can. But if you're a white person, you'd have to leave a little bit of that skin right there so the DNR can tell. Okay, because they want to be able to tell what, what species fish it, of is. Fish it is. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Okay, just keep on going down the... Okay. 